Hey everybody, welcome back. Slasher's Keep. If you didn't see the first episode here, you might be a little bit confused about episode two. Let me give you a rundown. We're kitted to the brim. It's nuts. We got gloves, we got a, a, a wand that is basically a machine gun, but we dare not fire it until we can find more ways. You know what? Charges 19. Charges 31 of 31. We can fire it a little bit. We have a Toxic Barb of the Void, which gives us better ranged knockback. Not really the stat I'm looking for. Everything else really just pumping stats. So we have like, our, our deck stat is through the roof right now, which means nothing to me. Just, just scouting the room out real quick, seeing how we might want to approach this. Obviously, we would like to kick them down the hole. Whoops, my mistake. Put this on number one. We would like to drink one health potion before we come in here. That's that's what I'm thinking about right now. Then we move. You stick and move. You knock him down the hole. Yo, you got me real good, actually. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, heal up again. Heal up again. We're gonna knock him down the hole. If you're an enemy, it's just that simple. You get knocked down the hole. We we don't engage in real combat. We simply knock him down the hole. Come on, man, come on. There's, you're not knocking him down the hole, you're just making him mad. <laughs> you can make it, you can make it, you can make it. Okay, they can't make it, though. Really? Okay, well, you gotta, you gotta stick in there, then. You gotta stick in there, then you give him one of those. Okay, now we're talking. Another one fell down, dude, another one fell down. Okay, these guys... You're nothing. You're nothing. Yo, have we finally hit mastery? I wanted to see because I thought we had melee knockback as well, but level up four attribute points and one skill point. I would like to learn more lifesteal, please, rather than anything to do with ice damage. Permalearn, thank you. Okay, now we have some melee lifesteal associated here. We get four more stat points. I think we want to go two and two. Strength and intelligence. Why? Keep it balanced. We have a, a throwable firebomb. A standard issue long cutter. Honestly, I'm a very simple man. If it doesn't have like a superlative, like if it's just called sword, not interested. If it's like Tim's godly sword of the whale, we'll use that forever. How about this? Melee knockback is better. 21 to 27, same speed. That's a gimme right there. Look at that. Oh. <laughs> and it taught us a skill. Bloodlust. Kill streaks now increase your melee and range damage by 4% per kill. That actually seems potentially like one of those things that's kind of not that amazing just in terms of the numbers. You're like 4%. But dude, 4% per kill? That's crazy. If we could just have a room with many kills. Okay, we got real problems here. What's what's our problem? Um, the caster... Buffs the crap out of all the uh, minions. So if possible, we want to kill the caster first. He's doing some woo-loo-loo-loo-loos. Standard issue cutter, I sleep. However, it's hard to kill the caster first, obviously, because the caster has all the minions blocking. But, I mean, we've already accomplished it, thankfully. Okay, there you go. If Bloodlust is coming up. Slice him down. I don't care if there's spider webs in the way. Get him. Get him. Oh, did you see? That was like a Twitch block. Twitch block. Not like a block on Twitch, but like I used my fast Twitch neurons. There we go. Now we're talking. That being said, did take some damage. So we're going to take a little sip of the potion real quick. A little embarrassed with myself. This is my best run ever, though, with that, without a doubt. We don't need spiders. We don't need spiders. They're poisonous. How do I feel about this? Here's how I feel about this. Pull out the piece. <laughs> no! I, in my head, I was like, let's just do it until we have, like, a few charges left, because I don't want to lose this wand. We have lost the wand. I'm, in, I'm embarrassed, because that wand was one of the best things that's ever happened for me. 
Now, yellow slime. Maybe this is orange slime. I want to get this guy first. It's target selection, sweetheart. Um, yellow slime tends to hold a lot of loot, I think. I think that's its thing. Every time I kill yellow slime, I'm, I'm always impressed with the drops. What the heck is that? Explosion? Let's go. Let's go. Well, I'm not impressed with the drop. On the other hand, we did get a potion. And it's a big one, actually. Let's put that on number five for now. Very important. I'm learning. We want to have as many... We want to make sure we're being very sensible with our, with our quick bar. You know, I, I was lazy about it before. I wasn't putting everything on our quick bar. We wanna we wanna change that, of course. Oh, a single mosquito. Sorry to bother you at home, sir. Is there like a where's your weak point? I don't seem to get many face hits on you. No, oh, never mind. Turns out we do. Tarnished pole. So this you use this for crafting, I think. As of right now, I have no idea how to craft. And I wonder if it's... <clears throat> I see two possibilities. One is that we come across crafting tables in the game. The other... Come on, man. You should be dead. You know it. I know it. The other... Hold on. This isn't even the weapon I'm supposed to be using. Did I not swap to the cool weapon? Or did I just pick it up and not change? I picked it up and did not change. Or I, I changed back, maybe? Accidentally? Um... The other possibility... Hit him with the knockback! The other possibility is that we, uh... Maybe get, like, a crafting skill. I hate to drink the super potion, but it kind of had to be done. And if you'll give me one second here, my cat would also like to come in. Hello, Tomo! Hello, Tomo! Welcome, buddy! I wish you better than your cat's desire and your... Wet food for the boy. Tomo, it's your birthday. It's not really his birthday, I think, but... Okay, just just stay in there. Beautiful. It's a beautiful move. Standard issue cutter. I sleep. Dude, we've leveled up now that we're actually using the traps to our advantage. I saw the, the potion back there. We're definitely still at the stage of the game where any time... We get a potion. Like, that That changes the game for us drastically. Okay, you got him. You got him. This is perfect. Go ahead. Go ahead. See? I know I know what's up. We got a little melee knockback. I guess we could just walk him off. <laughs> That's funny. Tomo, what's up, man? How you doing, brother? Let's put a potion of invulnerability out here as well. What? How you doing, man? Yo, we just need the we need the silver key, and then we're good to go for our next level. Very exciting news. And I'm hopeful, you know, because like you always are happy with a roguelike early. You go, whoa, new thing, new thing, new thing. We're going three piece now. Forget KFC strategies. You know, you're kind of blinded by novelty early on. I'm hopeful the game continues to to delight. Ooh, look at that. We can sort of see outside. I'm hopeful that the game continues to delight. Um, I've seen some screenshots on Twitter of people like who got further into the game. And it seems like there's some really cool stuff that happens. Like, you can get weapons that are... They have so many, uh, or so much of a description on them because they have so many, uh, like, uh, elemental effects and modifiers and stuff like that, that you actually have to, like, scroll off the screen. It's going, it's going. In order to see everything that they have on offer. That's, that's very appealing to me. Because, as you'll know, I love to read. I'm an avid reader. I've read all of the Goosebumps novels, at least prior to uh, the year 2001. Oh, let's go, dude! That's what we in the business call a combo breaker. I guess it would be a combo maker. What the heck is this? I've never seen this before. It must be a shop. 
To me, it looks like you put in a sword and you get a glove. Um, so what do we not... We don't need this. <laughs> we don't need this. We don't need this. Um, we don't need this. Maybe it's... <laughs> I have no idea what we're doing. You know what? Take all of my wands. Put this on number 7 on the quick bar. We'll keep this though, obviously. Okay. What, what the heck does this do? I don't know, man. I don't, I don't have an answer for you, but what's done is done. Yo, you see there's another thing over here. What the heck? Swap. Oh, this, this must be a shop. It certainly seems here like you sell weapons for gold, which is what I wish that I had done a second ago. Oh, but you got stuff for sale as well. Okay. Price 127. Unfortunately, I cannot afford that. Don't get yourself killed. It's a, it's a Dark Souls. Um, let, get some more money and come back for that guy. You have found a secret. Okay, so is this fool again, huh? Okay, here's what you do. Probably some of the easiest money we've ever made. Um, now pick up all this stuff. Anything that we don't want, we can sell. Why not, right? Why not? Inventory's full. That's all right. We'll deal with that in a in a minute here. Okay, you, sir. Let me let me look first. More damage gives extra intelligence too. What is this? Light axe blade filled with hate. <laughs> if only I could figure out how to um, how to actually make it craft, we'd be in business. I bet there's like a crafting merchant we'll come across. So here, you just. Take one of these. Money plus eight. We don't need it. We don't need it. Sells for three. Sells for eight. That's fine. Sells for eleven. I hate to lose the the melee or the, the bloodlust, I should say, but I think it's for the best. Inert mood ring. Why don't you go ahead and take that? Okay. And then I wanted to buy like a shirt. I think that's the right idea. Better melee speed is nuts. And then on top of that, we don't even have a shirt right now, so I can stop feeling weird. There we go. Keep moving, keep moving. You got anything for me? We've already been here. Oh, dude, we can go to floor three then. Toxic battering rod? Where the heck did that come from? What's what's wrong with the mace? Like, what do you give me? Bomber person? Grenade splash radius increased. 52? Dude, come on. You gotta go here. I don't know what arachnophobe gives. This sells for 11. I don't know what arachnophobe gives. Probably you can eat spiders for HP. Yeah. Oh, no. It, it restores a small amount of ammunition to your wand. That actually seems super good. All right. Now I got to figure out how the heck you get out of this floor again. I'm just I'm looking at the map. Rest assured, there is a map. And I am looking at it. Hello. My guy's like... Mega out of breath. What? <laughs> oh, do, maybe we just go through... No, because I remember we needed a silver key somewhere. I guess we should sell you this. Dude, this run... To me, this run feels like it's popping. I want to look at this weapon again. One sec. Oh, I thought... For some reason, I thought it did poison damage, but... Probably because it's called toxic. Hello. Hello. Surprise, surprise. Now that's damage. Haymaker! Dude, two hits killed him, though. Let's go! My favorite archetype of run. Click button, enemy dies. I told you these guys give you mega loot. Come on, we're trying to keep that XP cruising. Sorry, spider. Yum, yum. We don't... Really? You sneak attack me? I'm, I'm like, just swinging like a madman. I'm a little embarrassed, but... We, we probably do want to sell this loot. Oh my god, hold on though. Force Knight? Okay, shoulders are good too. Although this does take our decks away, but maybe the armor is worth something. The heck is Force Knight? Using kinetic wands, you may now lift and throw objects that are 30% heavier and push with 20% greater force. Look, I doubt we're going to get a ton of use out of that on this run. 
Just because I don't know what I'm doing. Oh no, I hate it. <laughs> okay, never mind. I'm fine. Never mind. I'm fine. You hear like mechanisms going off right here, by the way? Repost. Parrying an attack increases the damage of your next blow by 19%. That's insanely good, I think. And then we got some attribute points. You know how you know how we do it. Keep it as balanced as possible. Smite him. Dude. I'm telling you. We're pogged. That's the ooh. They rotate too. Okay, that's scary. I didn't mean to drink the invulnerability potion, but you know what? Seems like there are there could have been worse times for it. I actually meant to throw the fireball. <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead, brother. By the way, welcome to die. Scary pata of indulgence. We're going up. Alright, well. That was my bad. Certainly feel like the game does get harder. If that was something you're concerned with. Keep your concerns in a sack. You can do it. Don't fall. Don't fall. There you go. Good stuff. You got another firebomb. I know you're probably like sell the stuff that you just got. I think you're probably right. I think that's probably a great idea. I am a, a little bit confused about where I stand on the dungeon right now. But I also believe fully that this could be like a, a successful run, believe it or not. So we should, like, you might as well have all this stuff available. Hold on. I, I really like the mace. Like, I like a one-tap Marty, and that's what we're looking at right here. I think we'll just sell everything else kind of indiscriminately. Hello. Because why not? Sells for 11. It's not bad, but... Okay, so many crafting ingredients. One day we'll figure out what to do with them. Okay, help me out here. <laughs> Can I just get like a button that teleports you to the next level? It must have been... You know what, first off, let's hit the save button real quick. I'm like, I'm trying to go through the map in my head. And I'm like... Well, I'm confused, let's put it that way. Maybe we go right here. And then in going right here, we can go across here. And then... This is the... Help me. Help me. I'm lost. I'm all lost in the hyper dungeon. I can no longer shop Hapa. You guys like the clash? Okay, so this is where we started. Um... <laughs> Surely, I remember, we fought here. Bunch of bunch of minions, bunch of mosquitoes, and and whatnot. Th maybe this is the silver lock. I don't know if I would risk that ever again, but it was right here, dude, the whole time. Look at that. How embarrassing. Okay, we're going up a level. Your little brother had never been a good fighter, so his every swing missing came as no surprise. Sweating and stumbling, he mounted a final charge. An easy attack to dodge, but you stood your ground instead. Bindrick tackled you square in the midriff. You hit the dirt. Bindrick is victorious. In the Great Hall, you stood with the King and Bindrick. All right. I don't know. Like, uh, lore? Like I said, I love reading. <laughs> Not always my cuppa. Go ahead. You parried me? Since when did the enemies parry me, dude? Oh, dude, what a slice! He, that hurt like a son of a gun. Great map, though. Okay, hold on. Just a little... Just a little scared here, knowing how much damage these enemies do now. Just maneuver yourself into a good position. Spike them. More health potions, marry your health potions. What the heck is that? Volatile goop. Definitely throw that on your number eight. Copper key is required in order to get into that cell for treasure. Fair enough. Treasure. Do what I... You know what I see? Uh-oh. The door closed behind me. You know what I see, though? I see... Go ahead. Go ahead. 
Let's go. I, I can take off any number of you. Take on any number of you, I should say. Just gotta close the gap. Wait for the loot bag to be ready. Here we go. <laughs> you wanna fight now? Okay, I mean, if you wanna fight now, then let's fight now. Dude, the extra bonus damage from the parry. He never stood a chance. Come on, you know you're dead. That, uh, oh, take some potions. Take some potions, take some potions. You, you gotta realize, like, a single hit does a lot for the enemies right now. We still lose HP when we eat a spider. We just happen to gain, uh, wand charges. That's good to know. I see a, a, an anvil. An anvil equals upgrades or crafting. Either one of which I'm, I'm pleased with. Yo, this is heavy Dark Souls elements. This door is locked from the other side. This contraption does not move. Don't get yourself killed. The copper key! The copper key. Yo. Just go, go freaking nuts. Don't stop till you're numb. Shining foot armor of the shining star. We do lose force knight. That's fine. Yo, icy swings. Can we just slot that in? Absolutely not. Basic spadron. Basically, see you later. And then the wand. Bland blaster. Lightning magic. Why don't you go ahead and get on slot number two here. Okay. So we gotta be careful, obviously, like enemies are getting... You scared the crap out of me, dude. Enemies are getting a lot stronger over time. We got traps to deal with as well. Can't really afford to... Help. Can't really afford to take too much time. I'm willing to I'm willing to wait for this one. Go ahead. Not bad, not bad. Silver key required. You know what? That's the that's the path to the next level, so we're okay with it. I don't know how we're gonna get through here without taking a hit. Stepped on a pressure plate and it killed me. <laughs> I get you know what? It is what it is. We learned a lot on that one. Um, I just want to see where we're starting on this one now. Good good stats for sure. Still got a decent amount of money. And then we, we still have Bloodlust, which is nice. Okay. For now, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, click the like button. Helps out a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. Apologies for the shorter one. I didn't know. <laughs> I, was, I was getting ready to stay pogged. But hope you enjoyed it. And we'll see you maybe for some more Slashers Keep in the future. See ya.